killed many evil bastards with a bit. If it's made of solid gold, I'm just gonna chip off a few pieces. What the? Don't look at me, demon statue! Holy crap, you're creepier than the fucking monsters and masks! Well, Motherfucker. What the? This is a badass in terms of what this shit is. What the hell? This is seriously someone's bad acid trip. Like, there is no excuse for this bad ass acid trip. शंग्रिला की घंटियों की कहानियां सुनाया करते थे उनकी धवानियां धरती से बुराइयों को दूर करती थी वो मुझे चेतावनी देते थे तुम अपने माता पिता का कहना नहीं मानोगे तो घंटियों की धवानियां तुम्हें ढूंढ लेंगी मैं उनसे बहुत डर जाता था nowadays and punch him in the head, knock him unconscious so he can't continue to do it. I mean, I know it, it kind of adds to the moment, it's a really cool sound, but let's, I mean, does everything have to have it? Like, they could just make a new sound? It's always got to be the walrus farting. What happened? He's back in the world of the living. Uh... How'd I get here? Ah. I'm okay. Uh, he... He walked in holding a bank up. Right. And then you put it up in a frame here, and then curled up on the floor for a kit. Yeah. You want to try it? You're speaking a weird language. <laughs> what happened? I don't know, but it's fucking weird. Mm. Was that here when you moved in? Oh. This? I was told that it's a Gale family heirloom, been passed down for generations. Did I not mention that earlier? No, you didn't. Oh, Shoot with that 1911 you somehow you got. For the right, and we asked you to grab some of that wacky back here, eh? Uh, Did you find any? I was a little busy. Right, 
But you, That's good. You, yeah, yeah, no worries. You, yeah, next time. But you do come across that fanker. Keep us in mind. Right. Well, we're off. We'll send someone back here to clean up the rest of our shit. All right? All right. <gasps> Toodles. Toodles. Yeah. Toodles. Toodles. Oh yeah, the protection detective has arrived. And all this hippie shit in my house that I didn't know about until a few hours ago. Alrighty then. <laughs> Caretaker, of course it's built a bad guy. They couldn't be like bothered to make it anything else. Okay. Hmm. Trading post. Interior lighting. As you all know, I have a love to love love buzzer plane things. Which of course they put right underneath the tree or right underneath the tree. I can't tell. Oh, it's not underneath the tree, thank goodness. The hell am I holding? Oh okay, I'm holding a bow. <laughs> like what the hell did I just pick up off this thing? Can I fast travel here? Alright, so it looks like you can fast travel this place. Um, Alright guys, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to end this episode because the rest of this is basically going to be me traveling. You know what? Actually, no. I think we'll do the Yogi quest. What the hell? We're here. Let's start this Yogi quest thing. I didn't want to have to make you guys watch me travel to Noor and then just start a quest, not be able to finish it in this episode. So let's go ahead and start this Yogi quest. Probably get the cinematic in and then hopefully we'll be able to finish it quickly. See? It works! I, I, I can see through the wall. What? <laughs> Bollocks to that, you just heard his footstep. No, oh, no, 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 I'm deaf in one ear, remember Sao Paulo? Alright, the trombone player. Yeah, the one-armed trombone player. But now that now that AJ's here, he can settle our little disagreement. Indeed he can. Fucking guys. But he's our guest, so let us be cordial. Ah, be our this guest, one's be a lovely juggling. Mm -hmm. We call it Oculus Spliff. Oculus Spliff. As you see through the walls of perception. Or I guess but you really we need a topper with that one, mate. Oh, not again. Motherfucker. These guys are drugging me. Seriously. At what point do I just fucking shoot them and end it? I apparently can magically summon 1911s, so... What the hell, right? Dude, what... What now? Oh, that's not good. Where am I fucking going? Oh, you motherfucker. Seriously, right now? Motherfuckers. And I had to hear this goddamn music the whole time. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is gonna be fun attempting to get through here. Alright, so here we go. The 
This shit's giving me a headache. What the hell? Uh, oh, what the I? fuck? Oh. <laughs> Once again, this game does not surprise me. Don't mind me, bear. Just run and die. There's so many animals here. Tell me? What the fuck? Reggie's at you? Oh, shit. What the hell did those guys give me? <laughs> This is a whole other level of fucking drugs. Alright, I have no fucking clue how to reach these guys. I'll just follow the road, I guess. I don't feel like I'm in a great event. Awesome. Playing in the background. Let me come down. Oh, come oh, on! Of course! why I never ate Jerry Garcia ice cream. I swear to god, guys. Okay, I think it's starting to kind of wear off though now, so... It's getting a little less creepy. No, what I just said sounded way creepier. Oh shit. Ow. Alright you guys, I actually have to end this episode. I am sorry. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you in the next episode. How did you... How did this... Oh god, it's worse than I remember. We're only 30 What's seconds up, in, it gets much worse. Goro, and welcome oh. back to another episode of Far Cry 4. I do deeply apologize for cutting it off like last time. Worked out for you. But we're back now. You drugged me. We Again. offered, what you accepted. Brian, you still have all your bits and bobs. No harm, no foul. Besides, now you have the recipe. Right, and you can glean the benefits of its effects anytime you want. Like a superpower. Exactly. And there's plenty more where that came from. You just come on back to us the next time you need a little kick, yeah? Until then... Shall we? Yeah, okay, I hate this guy's a lot now. I have to check 